I didn't actually know that the council offered stuff like this. Obviously the council were heavily involved in that. What's the first thing they do? They call their local council. The closer you are, the more we care. Welcome to the District Council of York Peninsula. An easy two hour drive from Adelaide, the York Peninsula area produces about 25% of Australia's grain through our broadacre farming. Our population of just 11,000 swells to over 30,000 in the holiday seasons as tourists take advantage of our beautiful coastline and beaches. And what better way to experience all that York Peninsula has to offer than our new Walk the York concept. Walk the York is a concept plan. It'll be a walking riding trail right around York Peninsula. Circumnavigate the peninsula some 500 kilometres long. But we're hoping to link all the towns together and provide a unique opportunity for tourists and the visitors and the locals even. So, you know, we see there's lots of benefits for everybody for this trail. So we're looking at uh, linking into the Wakefield Regional Council here and then following the old railway line out um, through towards the hummocks and then following the road corridor back through into Port Clinton. The trail then will link the township circumnavigating the peninsula all the way around the coast, the whole entire way, down through the National Park, back up around the hill, through the instep, and right up the top of the foot where we're going to link again in with Copper Coast Council coming into Port Hughes. Well, we've got a lot of inquiries from people who want to come over here and walk, and also people who ride bikes. They're very interested in being able to get out in the open air and to actually see the countryside. It'll add a whole different dimension to the tourism that's interested in coming here. I can see this walk becoming as important as the Hyson Trail or the, the Cradle Mountain Walk in Tasmania. Recently been really fortunate enough to receive a grant from Regional Development Australia and that's a grant for half the trail which is 1.3 million so we're looking at a, around a 2.7 million dollar project here to complete the whole trail. We're looking at a three year process as part of the grant. I believe that's achievable. I believe I've got about 82 different sections that need to be completed, varying in length from a kilometre up to 15 to 20 kilometres. But once that all comes together in different stages, we will be able to link it all together. Whilst it's not one of our core activities, I believe that it's our responsibility to help encourage people to our area and to enjoy what we've got to offer. So I believe that part of Council's role should be to develop things like this for recreational use. There's nothing in it for me. My real passion is to make York Peninsula a better place and that's why I go to work each day and enjoy what I do and that's what I'm really going to get a kick out of is just making York Peninsula a better place and more interesting for people to come and, and talk about it and tell their friends and come and visit us whenever they can. For career opportunities with your local council, visit careersincouncil.sa.gov.au Councils get close to the things that matter to you.